This entire video is just me having an existential crisis, so maybe that's what I should title this video. OOTD. I look sickly today. I look so pale. Am I okay? I don't think I'm okay. It's been so long since I've car vlogged. It feels so good. This is honestly my safe space. This is where I belong. This is where I feel most comfortable. And in one of my videos, I talked about, you know, how I fake being a relatable teen. But today, I just feel like my teenage hormones are just taking a hold of me. And I... I feel really moody and bratty. Basically, today I feel like a teenager. Some days I feel like a 30 year old. Some days I feel like a teenager. And today, like, the teenage hormones are just raging. And I already had my period last month. I don't know what's happening. Or no, I had it this month. Yeah, I had it this month. It's only January. So, today's video is either, you, you might like it because, you know, I'm just freaking hungry. I'm just gonna shut up until I get food in my belly. Stay in the middle Oh lane. my gosh. Wow! Listen, Adele is a queen and she gets me through all my problems and if you don't stand then and all I ask is the best song in the world. So go listen to it. That is the song that I was screaming this whole time. I've arrived at the establishment. Ooh, I want it. I got it. I want it. I got it. What a good message to get the kids, you know. Happiness is the same price as red bottoms. Hey girly pops. Okay. Okie dokie. Ah, oh, man. Hey, girly pops. What is up? How are you? I got my Chick-fil-A. Oh, this is where I should take a thumbnail probably, right? All right, that's great. Yes, I really just did this. Wow. This is me trying to save the planet. I'm sorry. But every time you see me use a plastic straw, I'm trying my absolute best, but it's difficult to remember to carry it around with you and then wash it, but I'm trying. Where do I even start this? Hello. My name is Haley Fam. Welcome to my channel or welcome back. If you are an old subscriber, you might appreciate this video because I, I couldn't figure out what I wanted to do this week for Fam Friday, of course. And I was like, why don't I just do what I used to do, which is basically nothing. I would just get in my car, turn on my camera, turn on music, go to Chick-fil-A and then eat it. And that was my video. And for some reason, people liked that. And there's something about the simplicity that I just really miss. Sorry, I'm distracted because there's this dude. You're about to see him walk into the frame. Yep, I thought he was coming right for him. Okay, now he's just standing. Sorry, I'm really paranoid about people. Also, high makeup. This is for a different video. So yeah, I'm just gonna bring it back to my roots and I don't need to overcomplicate things this week. You know, I don't need to make some sort of clickbait title. Even though I might. What if I wore these? Remember these from my hipster transfer? Oh my gosh, I look terrible in those. I'm so hungry. I'm, just, I'm sorry, I'm just gonna start eating. If you have your food, you can join me. Ah. <sighs> this week it's been rough you know not not my greatest week ever i keep getting like horrible pieces of meat you know when like pieces of meat are just not ideal and they have weird parts i eat my meat or <laughs> i eat my chicken with honey i don't know who taught me this but ever since i was a child i always ate my chicken nuggets and my chicken sandwiches with honey and that's just the best way to do it i don't know what else to tell you oh my god it's so freaking good chick-fil-a is truly bad it even rhymes chick-fil-a is bae. Oh yeah. Chick-fil-A is bae. I just got the chills. So I haven't been having a great week. Yoga. Last week Ryan was here. My BF. Ew. I hate the word boyfriend. It seems so like second grade to me. So I always want to say like partner or significant other, but then that just kind of sounds pretentious. So whatever. So last week Ryan was here and I made six videos. I posted three main channel videos and three vlog channel videos. That's so many videos for one week. Like most YouTubers do one video per week and that is the work that they do for that week. Obviously with like other projects and stuff, but for YouTube that's all they post. And that's what I was doing for a while. Shouldn't I just like eat first and then talk? This seems kind of productive. I don't get mukbangs. How are you supposed to do this? So good. I'm going to cry because it's so good. I could literally make myself cry right now. I've not had a good week. Why am I so emotional right now? I'm really confused. I'm not going to get my period. I already got that. Ow, I just bit my tongue. Ate my sandwich, mom. Did I finish it? No, but it's fry time. Ooh, 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 fry time. Fry time is the best time. Anyways, continuing my story. 
Jeez. I honestly won't even start consecutively, continuously talking until the end of the video because right now I'm just munching down. And then Ryan left on Monday morning. We're long distance for now. We won't be in February, at the end of February, but I just, I got kind of sad, honestly. And what I've been realizing about myself is that I don't do well alone. I'm the most productive and most happy when I'm with a bunch of people. And so my aunt and mom are at my apartment right now, but every day they go and do stuff so that I'm home alone. And I went from being around people 24 Four, seven to just being alone and I didn't really like it so I kind of just like moped around thought I was getting sick there for a second and kind of was having like sinus issues so I just kind of like planned out videos and didn't do much I've been playing a lot of pool with my aunt I'm kind of like really good at pool it's really weird <laughs> Mukbangs are so annoying. I just want to eat my food. I don't I can't like give you a story and like say it because then I'm interrupted by food I'm just gonna eat first and then come back. I ate my food. I feel so good now uh, So I asked you guys on my Instagram what I should talk about in this mukbang and one of them said mental health <coughs> Oh my gosh, that was traumatizing Okay, what? Mukbangs are so stupid. First you eat and you can't talk because you're eating and then you're done eating and then your body is just like disgustingly digesting food and you can't talk either because you're just like uncomfortable. Freak my camera battery. Oh my gosh, you're kidding. No! Okay, so one of the things that you guys wanted me to talk about was <laughs> Which I thought would be a great thing to talk about because this Wednesday I have my first ever therapy session. Yes! Woo! Yeah! I've been wanting to go to therapy for a few months now and I just didn't know how to do it. But basically, I found this website where you just type in what your insurance is and then like what kind of prompts. Well, I typed in was my insurance. I typed in anxiety and I typed in Christian and female. It brought up a whole list of therapists in my area who are Christian, female, specialize in anxiety, and also take my healthcare or not my healthcare, my what is it called insurance sorry I'm not an adult yet well I am technically but not really and then I booked my first appointment so I really hope I like this lady the thought of telling her all about my issues is like kind of like really freaky but we'll see how it goes I'll probably vlog about it on my vlog channel <coughs> This week, I still posted a vlog on Monday, and today's Thursday, so I'm gonna post a vlog on Thursday. And I'm still posting my Fam Friday video as usual, so it's not like I'm slacking this week, but comparatively to last week, I was so motivated, so happy. And then this week, I was kind of like, Meh. I feel like one of the reasons why I thrive around people is because when I'm with people who I'm close to and I love I feel very myself. I feel very comfortable Okay, so my camera died as you could probably tell and I really wanted a car vlog But you know sometimes you just don't get what you want. So now we're in my bedroom. It's actually really cute Apartment tour is coming soon, but right now my aunt is inhabiting inhabiting inhibiting inhabit She is using my guest bedroom. Well, it's not a guest bedroom. She's using the the other room. She's using the other room. She is currently staying. Why is this so hard for me to say? Okay, my aunt lives in Idaho. I live in Texas. She's staying at my apartment and has been for two months because she's hanging out with my mom because they're sisters. And that room is going to be my office once she goes home. But for now, I don't have an office and that part's gonna be really cute. So I'm waiting until I can get my office together and everything to do an apartment tour. I don't know why that was so hard for me to say. But anyways, I was trying to figure out what I was gonna do for this week. And I was watching some of my old videos and I really kind of miss it. Like I feel like back then I wasn't really scared to like be myself and now I tiptoe around everything to the point where I don't even know who I am which sounds so freaking like gross and cheesy but if you read a hate comment this is turning into something disgusting but if you read a hate comment and then you like try to do the opposite to people please them and then someone makes a hate comment about that so you try to do something it's gone to the point where I'm like I don't even know what is me and what's not me so I'm just gonna make videos that I want to again and not really think about it and that is when my channel will get better. I'm gonna do things like just go to Chick-fil-A and literally do nothing in my videos because that's what I used to do and it's great, it's fun. So this week has been so bad. I just wake up and then I'm like, I don't I don't wanna wake up right now. So then I go back to sleep and then I wake up late and then I'm like, oh no, I don't really have motivation for the day. And then I try to do stuff, but then I'm like, oh, I don't have energy. I'm just gonna go back to sleep. It's just been a mess, okay? My life is about to get significantly better in like two weeks, I promise. I have so many 
many exciting videos and collabs coming and whenever I collab with my friends I'm so much more myself so I'm really excited for that because as cheesy as it sounds I really feel like I'm gonna find myself this year and really figure out who I am and then once I figure that out I can do it I can just be that in my videos and get back to where we started you know so although this week's video is actual trash the next few months are gonna be really freaking exciting I have been planning like crazy for travel and collabs and just life in my planner and bullet journal I'm gonna make a video about those little books on my vlog channel also my vlog channel has kind of been popping lately I love my vlog channel I feel like I have so much less pressure on there let's just do a little life update shall we I was looking through what you guys were asking me on my Instagram and someone asked if my mom has a job yet so if you have been subscribed for a while you would know that this past year my parents got a divorce we had to move out of the house and we are currently selling the house and my mom lost her job. <laughs> that all happened in one year, isn't that? Wild. So my mom and I moved into this apartment. Originally, it was just gonna be me living in this apartment And then we were selling the house and she didn't have a job So I was like, why would I make her go into debt and get an apartment? Like why doesn't she just live with me? And also I absolutely hated living alone I am too paranoid for that and like we discussed earlier with like me just thriving as a person with other people That was true for living alone. So I basically invited my mom to live with me Which sounds weird, but she is like such a sweetheart that she didn't want to invite herself to live with me so she was still looking for apartments to live at anyway even though she couldn't afford them and I was like mom like don't do that just live with me and she cried and it was like this very great sweet heartfelt moment and now we live in this apartment which is amazing and I am legitimately so grateful we were able to do that because if my YouTube stuff didn't start picking up and my mom had lost her job and my dad had just left us then like it would have been a really 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 scary time and YouTube is the biggest reason that I'm like not uh, just basically not I don't know how to say it without being dramatic but not even kidding <laughs> so that's why it's a little frustrating when people are like oh like you moved out just like the rest of the YouTubers once you got your YouTube money and you changed and I was like okay um I didn't move to LA I stayed in my hometown and I literally moved out of necessity so <laughs> Another thing that you guys wanted me to talk about more was my faith because I've been talking more about my faith and like being Christian and a YouTuber and that is something I will dive deeper into on my vlog channel. I'll do like a how to Bible study video on there and the reason I'm going to keep it on my vlog channel is because my vlog channel is a lot more personal. It's kind of for the subscribers who are like extra invested you know because there's like people who are subscribed here and this is like the only way that they see me ever but then there's some people who are subscribed to my main and they're subscribed to my vlog and then there's some people who subscribe to both channels and follow my Instagram and follow my Twitter so like there's different tiers basically of like how invested you are in my stupid life and I feel like faith is so personal and it makes me more comfortable to talk about it on my vlog channel so that is where I will keep all of that content my main channel is just for like more fun experience experiment videos so we're just gonna keep that off of this channel which I hope you guys understand but anyways 2019 the year where I make content that I want to freaking make like what am I doing right now nothing guess what I love it I just the point is I want to keep it more chill and am I having a breakdown in front of you yes yes I am I'm gonna go on Instagram and figure out what you guys want me to talk about because I'm just talking in circles right now something funny that my aunt always says is she was like Haley how long have you and Ryan been dating and I was like oh it'll be like five months on February 2nd and she was like why don't you guys like have a vlog channel together and she doesn't know the actual like vlog channel term but she was like why don't you guys do videos together on a on a channel and like people would love that people love relationships especially with the young people and I was like oh auntie if only you knew how many couples ended their relationship because of having a joint channel so Ryan and I will not be doing that but he'll be in my vlogs on my personal vlog channel and sometimes we will make videos together on this main channel but I don't want my relationship to be ruined by YouTube I don't want my relationship to become work if that makes sense near future plans I have my next 10 videos already planned out I guess I should just spill the tea on my plans because I didn't really do much else in this video so I might as well give you something you know so my family here on YouTube is coming to stay with me at my apartment for like two days or so and we're gonna film some really exciting videos I can't wait she's literally flying here from Canada which is so crazy and also I've never had anyone 
like sleep over at my apartment other than family so that will also be very interesting and I'm just so excited and then after that I go to Florida to visit Ryan for like 10 days ish and you know celebrate Valentine's hang out with Ryan Yero because they all live there together and it's like kind of the last time that we'll all be living together for like two weeks basically until we all live in separate apartments so that will be fun and then after that I'm going to Utah to see Avery and Marla and then after that is March and I'm going to playlist to collab with some of your favorite YouTubers and there's a lot of other exciting projects and photo shoots going on in March so it's gonna be very exciting time but right now I'm just kind of uninspired and unmotivated so that's what I've been doing but I'm getting therapy so that's productive at least I don't know having existential crises yeah that's me today that this entire video is just me having an existential crisis so maybe that's what I should title this video okay that is enough for this week what should we call these you know like girly chats but I call you girly pop so it can be like girly pop chats that was so dumb. Let me know what you think of these videos where I just sit here and talk because I've noticed that all my favorite YouTubers, I like them because they just do sitting down and talking videos, but I feel like I never even do that on my channel. So please let me know if you like these videos and make me feel a little bit less bad about myself for doing this. I don't know why I should feel bad, but I do for some reason because it was so chill. I don't know. I think I'm gonna call this video having an existential crisis for 13 minutes. I just guessed that this video is 13 minutes. If I'm correct, that's wild. Calm down, you're completely wrong, actually. If you liked this video, you can give it a thumbs up to let me know. If you're not yet subscribed, you can click that subscribe button to join the family. And also, if you are subscribed, you can press the notification bell because YouTube is a stinky butthole and it never recommends my videos to anyone because I'm just not lucky like that. You can also subscribe to my vlog channel. I post like three times a week on there. You can follow me on Instagram because that is the only place that I let anyone know that I launched a limited edition Valentine's merch collection and it sold out within the same day and we're not doing any restocks so if you wanted to know about that that is all happening on my Instagram and then Twitter is just like a stupid fun place you know so I have one of those too but other than that I love you very much I'll see you somewhere else on the internet God bless girly pops